Taz and Raja. And they've experienced a rather substantial change in their lives. People are always surprised to hear that you're a twin. And so it's pretty funny when I'm like telling, telling people about my twin and I'm like, it's just the opposite of me, basically. It's me, but long hair and yeah. female. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Taz and Raja were both designated female at birth. But Taz always felt uncomfortable in this gender role. Geez, I can think back to like grade two, grade four and that, and wanted to change my gender so I could go to my mate's birthday party because it was a boy's only birthday and they're like, oh, well, you can't go. And then I was like, oh, well, what if I do this? And they were like, yeah, yeah, let's do that. Uh, just to go to this party. <laughs> it's certainly very rare for identical twins to form different gender identities. So uh, when I started transitioning from female to male uh, about two years ago, I called Raja and asked her about it what she thought. She's like, you know, whatever does you is cool with me sort of thing. And it's been, a, it's been a bit of a learning curve for both of us. So when he had come to me and was like, I want to transition, I was like, yeah, that'd make sense because um, he's got like a lot more male mannerisms, if that's okay to say. Yeah. At first, when he was like, I want to transition, I was like, OK, like, you do you. That's important as long as you're happy. Like, that's my main priority. I don't think you appreciate the fact that you have some, like, an older brother looking out for you when you go out. Yeah. <laughs> he says I sober him up when we go out because he's, like, overprotective and stuff. But it's good because... Um, Guys tend to back off. Yeah. Real quick. Yeah. Which is good. It's so funny. It's cool because it's like having my own kind of like little bodyguard thing going on. Taz identifies himself as a brother boy. Brother boy, to me it means um, an indigenous female to male trans person. And um, that's you know, something that I've been able to reclaim because I, growing up I did have a lot of identity issues and so now I have something that describes me and I can own it, it's been really good, you know, um, I guess settling out those issues. But did Raja ever question her own gender? No, like, for me, anyway, like, I don't have any inclination to change my gender. Like, I feel like I'm in the body that I'm meant to be in and I'm the gender that I'm, like, I personally feel I am. Like, I think it's going to be individual to everyone, like, even if they are twins, just because one's, um, feels it, they've been assigned the wrong gender when they were born doesn't mean that, that the other one necessarily does. What caused the differences between Taz and Raja is a mystery. There's some research that hormonal changes in the womb play a role in the formation of gender identity. But the truth is, we don't actually know. 